everyone, welcome back. As you can probably tell, I am back with another haul video for you guys. This is actually an order that I placed at wag.com. Here is the store name in case you're interested in checking it out. So at this store, if you place orders of $50 or more, you get free shipping. Um, so that's why I went a little bit crazy and got everything that I needed and will need for a while to get the free shipping and also so I wouldn't have to go back to the pet store. So I'm just going to go ahead and show you guys what I got today. And it all came in different boxes, well not everything, um, because some product products were heavier than others. So I was just waiting for everything to arrive and it all arrived today so I, sh I can just go ahead and show you guys what I got. So the first thing that I got for my piggies was from Oxbow and it is this Timothy Carrot. As you can see, it's a little woven carrot that has little ropes on the sides, so you can attach it to the cage if you want. I'll go ahead and pick it up so you can see. It actually turned out to be pretty big, bigger than I thought. So I thought that this would be a good chew toy for them and will last them a while. So I just bought uh, one for each cage. And these were $3.99 each, but I got a one dollar and twenty cent discount um, on both of them together so it ended up being six dollars and seventy eight cents for these two the next thing that I got for my piggies was by Living World and it was these Lufa Nibblers one orange and one green so I got two of these one for each of the cages and these were um, two dollars and seventy nine cents each so I just thought it would be another good chew toy for them so the next thing that I got is by Ecotrition and it is the Snack Shack Fruit Chews um, that are for uh, rabbits, guinea pigs, and chinchillas and they're just in the shape of little apples so I decided to get this for them because I have a tunnel uh, for my piggies in this same material um, that the apples are made of and they really like chewing on it but I don't put it in their cage because they wee on it way too much so I just use it for playtime so I decided to get these because they really like chewing on them and I can just put them put these in their cage every once in a while as a little treat and I know that they'll definitely love it um, these were um, $3.99 for the package, but I got a 60 cent uh, discount on these and it ended up being $3.39. So the next thing that I got is by Living World and it is just the Living World plastic water bottle. I got two of them, one for each of the cages. They're not here right now because I put them in the cages. And this is just my final attempt to see if I can find a water bottle that doesn't leak. Um, but I don't want to get my hopes up too high, so um, I've put them in the cages so we'll see how they work out and maybe I can do a review later on uh, for you. So these were $5.99 each. The next thing that I got is for Barbok and Shinobi and it is a wear twiglu made of all natural willow. It's a wholesome hand-woven hideout and savory small pet snack. And I decided to get the big one um, because sometimes they say that the medium-sized ones are for guinea pigs on certain items and then I receive it and it's too small. So I decided to just be safe and get the larger one. And I know that they will absolutely love this because it's just really cool and they really love Willow. I know that they'll love chomping on this. They destroyed their last uh, willow tunnel uh, when I was away on vacation. Apparently they got really bored, so this one will give them plenty of willows to chew on. I mean, look at it in comparison to my hand, it's huge. It ended up being a lot bigger than I expected. Um, this was the, I think, the most expensive thing in the haul. Um, it's the Wear Twiglu, the large one, and it is, it was $11.49.
I also needed some food for the guinea pigs, so I decided to add it to my order um, to increase the amount and get my free shipping. So I just purchased some, the same one I always purchase, Oxbow Natural Science Adult Guinea Pig Food. And they actually sell it cheaper at WAG than at the pet store. Um, I got this for um, 10, let's see. Yep, ten ninety nine, and at PetSmart I think I've got it for fourteen ninety nine or fifteen dollars. So it's definitely a few dollars cheaper, which is great. And there's one last thing that I had in this order, but I'm not going to show it right now because it's Teasel's birthday present. Um, she will be one year old this Sunday, the uh, September thirtieth. So I'm really excited about that. She's already a year old. <laughs> It passed so fast, so I will definitely be making a little video of her, giving her her little uh, birthday uh, uh, food, a little special birthday foodie thing, and her present, so stay tuned for that. And one final thing, not really guinea pig related, but I decided to show, off, show it off anyway because I was super excited when it arrived this week. And it is my Bound Thesis copy. It's finally here. Yay! And so here it is. I had it sent out to for a binding about a month ago. And it just got back yesterday. So I was super excited that it got back. So there's the title and stuff. I'm just covering up names and stuff. Master of Science 2012. So yeah, I was super excited about this. And it's kind of hard to believe that I wrote all this, but... Yeah, I was really excited about about it and decided to show it off as so I've been showing it off to everyone like a little kid. And one last thing in addition to this. So yesterday or the day before, I got some mail from the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration Hurricane Research Division. And I finally got my certificate from my flight into Hurricane Irene uh, last summer and I was so excited. So. In case you didn't know, I am a hurricane researcher and last summer I got the opportunity to fly with the hurricane hunters um, on a mission into Hurricane Irene to collect observations. Um, it was a category 2 at that time. It was, it was definitely a great experience and I absolutely loved it. And now I finally got my certificate which I can hang on the wall of my office which will be awesome. So yeah, I just, I've just been showing these two things to everybody because I'm just a little kid that's excited about everything. So, but I'll stop rambling on for now and we'll go back to the piggies and show you what they do uh, when I put the new twig igloo in their cage. So let's go ahead and do that now. What is it? And immediately numb on it, right? Barma, go check it out. What is it? Look, you can go in the hole. Oh, do you like it? <laughs> I think they approve of it. Oh. Barmok. Is that delicious? What about you, Shinobi? Is that yummy? No, but you can't eat all of it now. It has to last. Oh. Where's Barbok? Barbok! They're both eating from the same side. Well, I guess that's it for now because the piggies have just started ferociously attacking the tunnel. And I think that by the time I get back home tomorrow from work, it's going to be destroyed. Um, Barbok, are you still in there? So I guess that's what I have for now. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and the piggies destroying their tunnel. So don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And feel free to leave questions if you have any. Um, and also leave your video requests so I can go ahead and do a video request for you and give you a shout out. So thanks for watching. Bye. Say bye, Shinny. Say bye, Barbok. <laughs> Bye.